Hi everyone welcome to Aero Raider the Sukhoi Su-30 MKK, a derivative of the Su-30 series, represents a significant evolution in multi-role fighter design, tailored to meet the specific requirements of the People's Liberation Army Air Force, PLAAF. Developed through a collaboration between Russia's Sukhoi Design Bureau and Chinese Defense Industries, the Su-30 MKK integrates advanced avionics, weaponry, and airframe enhancements, positioning it as a formidable asset in modern aerial warfare. The Su-30 MKK's airframe incorporates a higher percentage of composite materials compared to its predecessors, contributing to weight reduction and improved performance. Notably, the twin rudders, primarily constructed from carbon fiber composites, are larger than those on the original Su-30 MK, allowing for additional fuel storage rather than housing larger communication antennas as previously speculated. The aircraft's maximum takeoff weight has been increased to 38 tons, with a weapon load capacity of up to 12 tons, enhancing its multi-role capabilities. The Su-30 MKK is equipped with a sophisticated avionics suite developed to meet Chinese operational requirements. The aircraft features a glass cockpit with multifunction displays, MFDs, for both pilots, and an open architecture software design that facilitates integration with various systems. Communication systems include encrypted VHF-UHF radios with ranges exceeding 400 km, and HF radios with ranges over 1,500 km, supporting both air-to-air -air and air-to-ground communications. Notable advancement is the TKS-2 command, control, and communication system, capable of simultaneously managing up to 15 aircraft and their launched missiles. This system allows the Su-30 MKK to function as a mini-AWACS, coordinating complex missions and enhancing situational awareness. The Su-30 MKK has undergone several radar upgrades throughout its service life. Initial models were equipped with the N001 VEP radar, offering a detection range of 150 km against fighter-sized targets. Subsequent aircraft received the Zook MS radar, which doubled the number of simultaneously tracked targets to 20 and improved electronic counter-countermeasures ECCM, capabilities. Further enhancements led to the adoption of the Zook MSE radar, increasing the number of ground targets that can be engaged simultaneously and providing better ECCM performance. The aircraft's electronic warfare suite includes advanced radar warning receivers, RWRs, and the L-150 electronic intelligence system enabling detection and targeting of enemy radar emissions. These systems can provide targeting information for anti-radiation missiles like the KH-31P without relying on other onboard sensors. The Su-30 MKK is armed with a 30mm GSH-301 cannon and features 12 hardpoints capable of carrying up to 8,000 kg of ordnance. Its versatile weapon load includes air-to-air -air missiles such as the R-77, RVVAE, R-27, and R-73, as well as air-to-surface munitions like the KH-29, KH-31, and KH-59. Since its induction into the PLAAF in the early 2000s, the Su-30 MKK has served as a key component of China's air combat capabilities. Its multi-role nature allows it to perform various missions, including air superiority, ground attack, and maritime strike operations. The aircraft's adaptability has led to its export to several countries, including Vietnam, Venezuela, and Uganda, each tailoring the platform to their specific defense needs. Continuous upgrades have kept the Su-30 MKK relevant in the evolving battlefield. Enhancements in avionics, radar systems, and weapon integration have expanded its operational envelope. The open architecture design facilitates the incorporation of domestic systems, allowing operators to customize the aircraft with indigenous technologies, such as advanced helmet-mounted sights and targeting pods. The Sukhoi Su-30 MKK stands as a testament to collaborative defense development, merging Russian aerospace engineering with Chinese operational requirements. Its robust design, advanced avionics, and versatile weapon systems make it a formidable multi-role fighter in the modern era. As operators continue to upgrade and adapt the platform, the Su-30 MKK is poised to remain a critical asset in maintaining air superiority and executing diverse mission sets well into the future.